Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to learn about computer a machine. Now before knowing what is a machine, let us learn what are natural things. Okay, the things that are surrounding us, they can be either natural things or human made things. What are they? Natural things or human made things. Now firstly children, let us see what are natural things. All the living and non-living things that are found around us are called as natural things. Okay, living things such as birds, animals, insects, human beings, all these are living things. So, they are natural things. And non-living things children such as mountains, sun, moon, all these are non-living things. But they are natural things. They are made by God. So they are called as natural things. Now let us see what are human made things. All objects that are made by human beings using these natural things are called as human made things. Okay. The objects that are made by human beings. By using what sources? By using natural things. They are known as human made things. Okay children. Now what are the different natural things? Trees, mountains, birds, rivers, animals, human beings. All these fall in the category of natural things. Okay children? Now let us see. This is the cotton that we get from the farms. And now this cotton that is natural thing. It is converted into a t-shirt. So this is a natural thing because this is, this comes from a plant. Okay, we have not created this. But from this cotton, we are making a t-shirt, a t-shirt made up of cotton. So, this is a human made thing. We take this cotton, we take it to a cotton industry, there we manufacture it and then we get a t-shirt. So, all this is done by human beings. So, this becomes a human made thing. So, from a natural thing, a human made thing is made by human beings. Okay? Now, let's see the next example. Now, this is the iron ore. This is found in mines, children. And this is a natural thing. It is already present in the earth's surface. Now, from this iron ore, we are making an iron gate. Yes? We can see this example. We are making an iron gate. So, from this, iron ore is converted to iron gate by human beings. So, this is a human made thing. Now next, these are eggs. These are natural things. Okay, these come from hen. So, they are natural things. Now, we make an omelette out of this egg. So, this is a human made thing because we make this omelette. This does not come naturally. So, from eggs and omelette is prepared. Eggs are natural thing. Whereas, omelette is human made thing. Okay, children. I hope you got the difference between natural things and human made things. Now, let us see what are machines. Now, machines are human made objects that make our work easy. Now, for example, previously people did not have vehicles. So, they used to go by rickshaws. So, it used to take so much of energy of human being to pull that rickshaw. But now, as advancement have taken place, now people have their own vehicles. So, these vehicles are made up of some machine. Due to this machine, our human work has been made easy. So, these machines are human made objects that make the work of human beings easy. Okay? They have many parts. They use some or the other form of energy to work. Now, any machine children, it uses some sort of energy to work. It does not work on itself. Now, these machines can run on electricity, petrol, muzzle power or battery. Okay, they cannot work on themselves. Now, these are some of the machines that are found around us. Let's see children. This first one, we have a television set. In this utilizes what form of energy? It utilizes electricity. Okay. Fridge. It works on electricity. Now sharpener. Sharpener uses what form of energy? 
we use our hand and we rotate our hand. So, this uses muzzle part. Okay, sharpener works on muzzle part. Now, next fan, it uses electricity. A stapler. Stapler uses muzzle power because we are using the power of muzzles. The next mixer, it works on electricity. Next one is car. This uses petrol or nowadays battery and electric driven cars are also available. So they can use different form of energy. Now machines use some form of energy. What are they? Electric energy such as fan, fridge, television set. Petrol is used in cars and autos, muzzle power, sharpener, stapler and scissors. Now this is a desktop computer children. It is also known as personal computer and we cannot carry this because it has many parts like a CPU, a monitor, a keyboard, a mouse, all these parts are there. So we cannot carry this. These are mostly used in schools and offices and we cannot carry them. Now next laptop. This is a laptop children. Laptops are smaller in size. Now as compared to the desktop computer, these computers are smaller in size and they are very easy to carry. You can fold them and you can carry them with you. So I hope the computer chapter is clear to you children. If you have any doubt, you can write them in the comment section. Now there is a question for you children. Name any 5 machines that run on electricity, muzzle power and battery. Ok children, do write the answers in the comment section. Thank you. If you enjoyed our video, do give it a like, share this video and subscribe to our channel. Bye.